More than most states, Arizona is affected by and divided by the immigration issue. While Hillary Clinton is pledging a softer approach towards migrants, Donald Trump wants to make it harder than ever. Near to America's border with Mexico, I met a man who's implementing his own unorthodox policy. What's the motivation? Why, why do you want to do it? I love my country. It is what it is. Ex-paratrooper Tim Foley leads a group of armed civilian border enforcers. They can't stop illegal immigrants or drug smugglers, so pass their secretly filmed footage of them, like this, to the authorities. Put together a database on the trail, what times they come through, how many come through. Basically, we're just, we're pretty much an intelligence gathering unit. But whoever wins the election, Tim expects to still be doing these controversial migrant checks for years to come. They have guys on that mountain there, mountain over there, mountain over there. So you have to try to get in at certain times of the day. Uh, but as I go, I look for sign on the ground of activity coming through. See the depth of that track? That means he's carrying something, and something big. So he's probably carrying dope. It's not about race because we have uh, people from 78 different nations coming across the border. It's about sustainability. How do you sustain this many people coming across? You build a wall and nobody's there to watch it, then... It needs people, not walls. Right, exactly. Boots on the ground. It is currently just a fence which separates America and Mexico, and it stops just here. If America chooses Donald Trump as its president next week, he's vowed to build a 40-foot wall here all along the entire 2,000-mile border. What does all this rhetoric mean for the immigrants who now legally live in America? In Arizona alone, over a million Latinos are eligible to vote, but large numbers don't. So volunteers from this group in Phoenix are knocking doors to boost turnout. Okay, first we have on Clinton because she's very nice. And you, and you worry about Donald Trump? I worry about, yeah, I worry. I wish he's now winning. Well, we've been doing this summer. And in this closely fought state, the Latino vote could swing it for Hillary Clinton. Donald Trump has been saying a lot of negative things about the Hispanic community. Um, so not voting is voting, right? Because it's making it easier for the other candidate to win. Many have described the race for Arizona as an immigration referendum. A referendum, as Britain knows, can deliver surprises. Julian Drucker, 5 News, Arizona.